It was the plan that, if successful, would have changed the course of World War II, a simple plan to kill Hitler. Many had already tried to kill Hitler, even before the World War II had broken out. Throughout some of the plots, they're very close to succeeding, but Hitler seemed to have his own guardian devil surviving every single one of its plots, and far against the Führer's ordinary nuts or... Upon the assassinations, him or the shadow conspiracies of the acrobats of army officers who feared Hitler was going to lose the war and drag them Germany down with him. Hitler seems the scent of latency, of fret after 1941. After the start of more withdrawals of public appearances, his personal security has become more robust, explaining the numbers and the ranks officer has access to him. It was preceded accelerated as the German defeat at Stalingrad in 1943, that coupled with Hitler's uh, declining health. The appearance of the Führer became increasingly rare and, spending most of his time in the glory Eastern Front headquarters, the Wolfschleier, the British following the successful operation of Antwerp when the British trained Czechoslovakian agents successfully assassinated Rick Hunstein in Prague in 1942, started a bigger picture of knocking off the German leader how to cut off a German's head. How to get to Hitler, though? He was probably most closely guarded world leader, and the British needed to discover his armor, his weak spot, and to exploit his intensity of studies, began on Hitler's movement and properties. The guard arrangements, and unlike the German officers' conspiracies, Hitler and the British had no inside man and on special operations. London had studied Hitler's intensive culturing and mass information after D-Day landings of June 1944. Several SS soldiers who were rotated back to the front lines from Hitler's personal staff was captured by the British. One of them, surnamed Dyson, was able to collaborate on both Hitler's routines and the Birkhoff house. Albert Dyson of the near Birkhoff and the guarding arrangements of the private home that was difficult event to plan a major courtroom and the officer responsible for a complete finesse study of his work has been cut out. The Obersteisten complex was basically a private village in Austria, the home of a series of hotels, guest house, and homes of the senior Nazi leader, such as Hermann Goering, was carefully guarded by the SS. Martin Bormann, the Führer's secretary, and the party lead chancellor. In the change of the Obersteinstein, the private Nazi village was created as a special reserve for the people, a square of kilometers of an entire area wild off to the public. The mess defenses, defenses of electrified, was studded and was wired the gates of a watched arm sentries. The VVAC was the name of the infantry battalion, the permanent station where the area when Hitler's resident security was arranged, the big and fury baton of the Führer's escort and resort of the 19 personal assistant bodyguards and the Reichsführer, the rest SD, Auburn, the area was divided into three district or barbarians of the Barkis accomplished to an area and the buildings immediately of the Berkhoff. The Berkhoff too was a territory, but excluding the Kenton area, the housing of famous Ego Nest House, RSD officers also manned the outside gates of the village, and the Tankhoff when Hitler's in resident of Berkhoff Free was covered, and the supply of maintenance and the guard shift it was cornered and outsiders, different color pass, and was required for the Berkhoff security zones. All cars would have stopped regardless of rank or uniform. The passengers, however, were one of the most possible times that Hitler could be vulnerable to assassination. It's when, during his afternoon constitution walk, took every afternoon with a small collection of intimidation of officers, 
to his tea house, walked in less than a kilometer across the Baron Valley, and crossed the Margin Hills, the circle tea house that was built in 1937 on Birkenholders. Alders. The path was mostly wooded, and, at this point, the scenic overload of the valley, the railings, and the Fuhrer often sat on the paint. Hitler often fell asleep in the Marcia, as the cop would driven the Berghof back, intimidations, and the foot of the late afternoon, and the soul of the greatest ally carrying operations to kill Hitler of the OBA. Hitler was himself, who seriously disliked being guarded during his afternoon walk. The SS guard told him to remain out of sight. Well, the Fuhrer had his party, and the SS Divenfuhrer, who worked as a bodyguard for Astonfin, called a private investigator, and the British Normandy landings had set on Hitler to scroll past another patch of wooded land. The static SS sentry post was meant to be a symbol of opportunity to kill Hitler. The idea of attracting such a soul and considering extending to kill Hitler as well as the Birming detailed the investigations of the habits. The guarding of made working informant on Hitler's major courts and colleagues in London. He began to work how to assassinate Hitler in the Obersteifen and remained the method of sniper attack when Hitler was walking along the path to the tea house. He was very lightly guarded on the outlines and the planes of a German speaker and a British sniper would parachute into the These uh, said his uncle, Tyson Fuhrer, who was a strongly anti-Nazi, would hide the two assassins in his house in Alberstein, only 30 kilometers from Alberstein. The two-man rifle team would infiltrate the dressed as a German Army Mountain Troop uniform. They were based on the quite close of Demersfund, and the course of uniform were designed to covert attention to patrolling guards that would neither try to obsess or the security zone of guarded gates. They would have no necessary documentary that the armed special forces had the silenced pistol for self-protection. The fewer security zones, they would infiltrate through the fences. Once inside the enclosure, the team would lie and wait when Hitler takes the path of a regular walk. The pose of acting spotter and the sniper will be well armed with a 96k rifle filtered with themes and times of a telescope sight. The rifle had an effective range of one kilometer, but one shot would be taken much closer range, about 300 meters. The British officer, Captain Irvin Curran, was the mounted route of the sniper that had been began training in England, moving against alternative targets and scenarios, also lashed out of the second assassination that along the roads of by Hitler's car would bring him to the Burkhoff to the Muslim cop tea house. The assassination would be armed with a peat anti tank weapon that would destroy the car and the rifleman would fail to get a shot off of Hitler when he was walking in November 1944. The Major Corps presented this codename, Operation Foxy, but it was turned down after some heated argument. At the stage of war, of the senior officers felt Hitler's alive was doing more damage to the German military than Hitler's dead. So, in the reserve and making Hitler, the martyr threw the assassination through him.